Yeah, Scovey, the left-hander, his first shot. Knocks it down from downtown. Santiago with the three. To Rick Barnes, and how about that? Two for two for the new guy from Uruguay. Two pointers. Santiago Vescovi with his third triple in his debut. Get a ball. Oh. Vescovi to Barnes. If that's a sign of what's to come offensively here at Tennessee with Vescovi as the guard. I'm waiting for one of those passes all game long. Terrific dish by the newcomer. Fulkerson. Well, if these are the percentage shots that we're going to see taken in the second half. They again, Vescovi. Just as I uh, queued up, Javante was a little slow on the closeout. 77% coming in this afternoon. Another nice no look for Vescovi. To Find rebound, Vescovi got it. No problem with that, and Will Wade slaps the table. And that'll get the crowd up. Bosses in three of their last four home games here. Vescovi doing his best to prevent that. His sixth three. He'll run out for bout, and he'll take it himself. He's got a couple of easy buckets, point blank range. That'll help us slow. Me and Benjamin Button. <laughs> yeah, Adam too. Vescovi rattles it in from deep shot. I agree. He should have continued to his strong hand. Counters are overrated. Great pass right there. They got Pons deep. They are going to Eve Pons, and he is making good decisions with the ball. Can he make it two in a row? Indeed. They're not going to read his face. Oh, and Vescovi ends up with a gift from Kobe Brown, and he finishes at the other end. Watch how he change of speed, change of direction. And a lefty knocks down the three. He Come hits up. six in this first. Well, this is a big year for Frank Martin. He knows it. That's a big slam dunk by Fulkers. Up top, knocked down. Vescovi hits nothing but net, and it's down to a three-point. By the way, there is a Uros Plavic signing, sighting right now. You've got this Serbian who's in the middle of the pit wearing one. Oh, nice pass. There's Plavic. Yeah. Tennessee's got four freshmen on the floor. Vescovi, he's hit a bunch of those in the early goings. Cuts. Oh, and he spins it in. Right. Vescovi leans in and scores. So a good Sagan, another guy winning DNA, former Class 4A Player of the Year. Fulkerson, a senior into double figures for the 12th time now. The defense a big part of that bucket. How about some two weeks back? I love Stackhouse's demeanor, his composure. On another vicious dunk for. He has not been shy when it has come to looking for his shot either. So two freshmen, that will be a staple here moving forward. Vescovi for three. Long angles. It's the collaborative replay. It is totally, like you said, increase the efficiency of the process. With a higher degree of knowing where you are, and that's a mistake that time. Defense. The Tennessee has an eight-game win streak. The team's from the Magnolia State. Vescovi with another takeaway. What a dump to Fulkerson. And he'll go to the free throw line. Some are just absent-minded, and some were because there's been no sense of accountability in his previous playing days. He's also capable of that. And, and if that's 19 feet, and it's not a three, or it's 17 feet, and people go, that's not a good two because Tazer making a three. Lucas left it short. Here's another one of the lefties, a newcomer, Santiago Vescovi. Wow. Tennessee walkthrough today, it was make him guard. Take a charge. Do what you can to try to get him out of the game. And that, up that second foul, they went to their big lineup. That's where most of this run has come from. All right, Holly, thank you. Boy, another tough shot made by Visco. Whether it was Kamwa or whether it was Johnson, I don't know. But that shot was smothered. Viscovi, nice dish. And Pons with a slam of his own. Shot clock, sound like a broken record, down to five. There's a takeaway. Vescovi to the basket. 
Gives it up to Savion Flag. Tapped around to Fulkerson. Nice strong AM just on an 8 0 run. And now their leader, Nebo, on the bench. See what they do without him. Aku checks in. Here's Ponce. And he was doing that. Scobie will try a three at the hole, and that one does rattle in, so that'll give us our five. Tennessee by one. Nice look. Kevin Love, tons of all-stars, outstanding career. Here's Vescovi, very Ginobili-like, getting into the line for the balls. Goes that little fadeaway. Not happening just yet. Vescovi, there's the long rebound, heads out to... Field goal story, Mississippi State just over 50%. Vescovi again, he'll pull up from that elbow, and that one goes down, I'm telling you. So many left-handers. Mississippi State was plus 21 with him on the floor. Here's Vescovi stepping out. Oh, nice rebound this time by Fulkerson. Extra possession for the Volunteers. How about this pass? Ball whipping around the key. Vescovi! Oh! Finishes the best offense. Again, watch Fulkerson. Fulkerson falling for it. Got a tough matchup against Perry. Able to alter the shot. Johnson came away with it. Vescovi puts another three and off the second chance. Not two. And this Bulldogs defense trying to clamp down. Here's another long one from Vescovi. The last time he tried to throw that pass, squeeze that one through for two for Bama. Really does not look like a freshman. He could <laughs> test here. Pons can hit this three. Reese closed out effectively. If he was heading up court, no one boxing out. Vescovi has a bat. Along with Nick Weatherspoon, got him back playing well out on the perimeter. Oh, the big guys for Tennessee has helped the Vols oh. get back into this. And the ESPN app. Great SID at Tennessee. Tom Sitkoviak, he was swing. Vescovi <laughs> drops it off for Fulkerson. Tennessee working their way to the foul line. The lob and Fulkerson with. It's a play on. Down to seven. Is noted. Maxi. Tough shot. Difficult fadeaway. Knocked to the outside. Controlled by Bowden for Tennessee. Collectively rebounding well, Tennessee. Tennessee has missed seven of its last eight shots. They trail by three. Nice go. Pop. Pretty fake. A second fake, and he flips it home. Here. Santiago Vescovi with a nifty play. Uruguay special delivery. Vescovi, contact. Johnson a three. Bottom. I think he used some outside shooting. Johnson 34% from three. Vescovi a three. Every time you think Kentucky might open this thing up. Vescovi, shot clock winding down. Oh! Vescovi hits it from South America. And burn north of the equator or south? Got it. Vescovi, three on the way. Bottom. That John Calipari wants a timeout. Great recognition. Three, Kentucky. Scobie trying to make a move. Richards was lurking. Now Fulkerson with the four, you got to use him. Scobie, skip pass to the corner. Johnson drains it. A Twelve in the second half. The switch now. Dump it down low. Pons kick out. Nice recovery. Scobie got a three, and they switched. Richards was on him, good communication, but didn't close out. Back to your point, it's got to be a player like Sills to aid Jones on the offensive end. Vescovi with his first pass. That's what we call back in the day a teardrop. From 23 feet. How about on this for Henderson? Critical, but again, that's one pass, step back three against a set defense. And it's just a tough shot. Santiago Vescovi. I mean, it's got to be better player movement. Coach Musman, again, talked about that today at nauseum during shoot-around, telling his players they got to move. They can't stand and watch. Sesson shot 
48% from the field in half number one. Arkansas less than 30%. Viscovi has 15. Pons with the defense. Viscovi transition three. <laughs> Fulkerson on the cut. The tip for offensive putback opportunity. Fulkerson. Viscovi gives this team on a nightly basis. Two points or 20 points is like an extra bonus. Oh, with the stuff. And we still have an opportunity to right the ship. Oh, my. What can he do? Vescovi to Pons again. He Hannibal's ability, but he says you, you can't play the game the way you did in high school anymore. You've got to be crisper with your passes, and be better with your shot selection. And Tennessee looking for a good shot. That is a good look. And that is a wide open three. Now, what does the committee like to see? Road games. Great backdoor cut. Woo. Well, isn't that great from a coaching standpoint? You call a guy's number and he delivers for you. This guy's been delivering, and he's got the answer. A silence out. On the back door cut, you just can't make that pass. Viscovi around the screen. Back to Fulkerson. Give and go. And they protect the basket. Viscovi finds Pons, who gives the rim a workout on another stuff. That... Steal by Bryant. Viscovi stole it back. Fulkerson got it. Ten. Accustomed to and attached to as it defined their program. Vescovi would not finish in the paint. We talked about that efficiency. It's not there for John Fulkerson tonight. Just one point on 0-4 shooting. Lee gets his hands on another one. And you can see the double is coming. Good extra pass. Late rotation by Vandy. Tennessee makes some pay. Baton Rouge, rebound, second and assist and steals, led him to a couple state championships. And he's having a coming out party tonight for Vandy. That might be the guy that Jerry Stackhouse just picked up on a 10-day. He has certainly played with a sense of urgency tonight. Good curl right there. Set play, getting the slip by five and five and a half. Great block out by Vescovi. Found himself on educate. Obina blocked him out early. Very fundamental play from the freshman from Uruguay. Vescovi tees it up. Tennessee trying to pull away. Vescovi through Fulkerson. Tough wow. catch right there, but E. Ponce doing what E. Ponce does. Took his lunch money. Those are winning plays. Possession after a poor entry pass. Now Vescovi to that left hand. Finger roll. 14 for Vescovi. Already a turnover and two free throw attempts for Auburn. Flanagan, a freshman, only a 13% three-point shooter entering the afternoon. Pons gets it to Santiago. Here he comes down the paint. Left-handed finish, and he's headed to the free-throw line. A lot of international flavor between these two teams, certainly from Tennessee. This is McCormick. So much confidence of late in the rebound tracked down by Gaines. Open three off the skip pass. What is, or you throw it into the post and try to let focus and go to work against the smaller Macklemore. Auburn has not lost here at home since last February the 13th. 14 straight wins in this building. Vescovi breaking this entire first half. There he is again. Got a little ball screen. That sets up a 14-footer, and that time as a high IQ basketball player, Jimmy Witt Jr. Read the scouting report now got beat off the dribble are behind those three so things will get interesting keep in mind south carolina plays at alabama saturday and starts spraying as a passer but florida is at their best you have to contain them hard in this game that's kobe being pounded up high there's eve ponds that's kobe on the tank Fulkerson wants it. Vescovi from NBA range. Next two or three possessions for Tennessee. They better use clock, take care of the ball, and get a good look. Hey, bench points are up four to nothing now, Florida. Oh, That's you. Over the zero yeah. zeros we had. Yeah. Vescovi. Head up the foul. What a tough. And I said in the first half, 
If he's not an all SEC player this year, one of the top eight guys, there's really something about 40% in terms of the confidence that they release the ball with. Vescovi finds it. Bowden in the paint, kick out. Vescovi wide open three. Tennyson. Vescovi on an open trip.